Merry Christmas, Gemini. This is Jackie Tomlin, and this is your general reading for the week of December 24, 2018. Thank you guys for stopping by. And as always, if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, subscribe, retweet them. I greatly appreciate it. If you're seeking a psychic reading, contact me at JackieTomlin.com or find a link to those readings below this video. You're coming into some good energy. It's not a good week for quick decisions. I'm really seeing you guys are taking the time to work out some self-esteem issues. You're lifting yourself up, and I love seeing that. It is a good time of counting your blessings, both spiritually and financially, um, as well as I'm seeing a renewal with someone from your past, and amusement, meditation, uh, positive changes on the home front. So let's take a look. This is for Gemini, and this is for your week of December 24th, 2018. Gemini, we start with the King of Wands, followed by a Major Arcana of Judgment. The King of Pentacles, we have Gemini appearing in Gemini. The Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups, and a major kind of the fool. So let me break this down for you guys. Starting with the King of Wands. King of Wands shows you're taking authority. You are getting things done. You are checking things off of your to-do list and you're moving forward. Judgment is calling for you to pass judgment on someone in your inner circle. Okay? Don't see a confrontation, but this is you passing judgment on someone. Next to that, we have the King of Pentacles, also indicating financial stability, but this is Gemini appearing in Gemini, where you're taking authority. It shows that you're grounded, you're centered, you're well-balanced, you're ready to move forward. Now, moving forward, we have the Ten of Cups, and the Ten of Cups indicates happy home, positive changes on the home, not exactly where you want to be financially, but a lot of happiness on the home front. Next to that, in general, we have a new beginning. The new beginning is coming into the love life. This is a large factor for my singles out there as far as bringing in something new. And for my couples out there, it's a, a renewal. It's just intense. It's a wonderful time for love. Beside that, you have a warning card. There is the fool. Don't get so caught up in this happiness that you're making foolish decisions. Slow down. Think things through. No quick decisions this week. Moving forward, you guys have the chariot. You have the empress, as well as the um, page of wands. Let's give you one more. There's that six of cups. Okay. So the chariot. Love, love, love the chariot because this is good luck and abundance. Your yes answer. The nice thing about the chariot, totally and completely unexpected. Then we have the empress. Going back to that happy household. This is the mother card. Things are right on the home front. Now, the Page of Wands is indicating a message. This is why I pulled y'all an extra card. What that message is, is the Six of Cups. Like I said in the beginning of the video, this is a happy renewal with someone from your past. It doesn't have to be the long distance past, just someone you've not seen or heard from in a long time. Just a very good communication card. Okay, so what you guys are looking at. First of all, there is someone you need to pass judgment on in your inner circle. Next, no quick decisions. Remember the fool is at play here, so be mindful of your decisions. Don't get so happy that you're not making wise decisions. The chariot, unexpected, good luck and abundance, your yes answer. And then, of course, we have the positive changes and total complete happiness on the home front. So thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. Merry Christmas, and I will see you soon. Bye.